I'm first going to part my hair across the middle to make, to make a high ponytail. And then I'm going to tie up the top part because we're going to start with the back. The hair that I'm using is from Gigi Glambox, the Mongolian water wave that I had in a while back. Um, so what you really do is measure the track from left to right, and then you just cut the weft um, right where you need it. I'm using the 30 second um, bonding glue from my beauty supply store and the little small <coughs> spritz because you spray the spritz on after the glue to help the the track stick on your part really good. Once you have the glue on, you make sure you try to position, see if you can fill your part first and then lay the track down and just press it in. I also go in with my blow dryer just to make the glue dry really, really fast before I move on to the next one so you just proceed with the same step throughout the back of the hair and I tie it up as I go just so I don't get too much hair in the way The amount of tracks you need is based on how full you want your hair to look. I put about six tracks because I want it pretty full for my liking. So my camera died when I was doing the top and I was really annoyed because I wanted you guys to see. So right here I'm putting in the last track and all of, at the top part of the um, high ponytail, I'm just doing them straight across to the back. So when I pull it up, it'll go in the nice ponytail. So I'm just showing you guys all the tracks that I already did. And they're just straight across. So, you know, I'm just showing you guys right here. I think I did about four or five. And that's it. And all of the front is mine. And the sides are my hair too. So I can put it in a nice, nice flat ponytail. All right, guys, that's it for the in-stores, but don't leave because I need y'all to see how I style this hair, right? Don't leave. So the tool that I'm using is a curling wand from Remington. This isn't mine, so hey Naomi girl, I'll give it back to you soon, <laughs> I think. <laughs> I'm wanding the hair away from my face to create more of a wavy curl. I'm grabbing medium parts and I continue that throughout the whole back of my head. And oh hey bae, he called me and disrupted me. So. Bear with me guys, and I continue this throughout the whole back of um, the edge control that I'm using is Olive Miracle Silky Smooth Edges from African Pride. Gotta slick the edges down. Don't forget to have your edges on fleek, hunty. So now I'm just following the same steps in my ponytail curling the hair away from my face and I'm gonna do this throughout the whole ponytail. So I'm just teasing a little more and making my ponytail really, really big because I like my ponytail to match the rest of the hair and I kinda wish I put more tracks, but it's okay, I'm gonna make it work. So right now, I'm also gonna cover up my rubber band with my real hair and um, an extra track, just wrapped it around and covered my rubber band so everything would just look seamless. This 
this is my version of a half up half down hairstyle and i hope you guys enjoyed hit that like button subscribe and comment be sure to live your dreams don't dream your life guys